Have you seen DAW written on your prescription and you want to know what it is? There's actually several different codes, so let's go through it. First things first, DAW means dispense as written. And we have 10 of them. First one is DAW0. This just means you can usually just dispense whatever's written, which is usually the generic if it's available. Next is DAW1. That means if your doctor writes this, even if the generic is cheaper, I can't substitute it unless I get permission from the doctor. And some doctors, nurses, or people that work at the office, they may accidentally click this and it causes us that we have to call them because a patient's not gonna pay $1,000 for a medication. Next is DAW2. Because the pharmacy always has to dispense the generic if it's available, the patient has to request the brand name if they want it. So yes, if you didn't know, you do have a choice to choose between the generic or the brand. But unless you had some severe side effect with the generic, your insurance is not gonna cover the brand name. And then number three is substitution allowed pharmacist selected product dispense. And this is usually what you may see when you're changing manufacturers. DAW4, so if the generic medication's not in stock and the brand is able to be dispensed, the patient's able to pick it up, you can choose that one. And this is just when the doctor opens Okays that you can dispense the generic, but you dispense the brand. Number six is override. Honestly, I don't know what that is used for. DAW7 is pretty much the law prevents the patient from getting the generic. And DAW number eight is pretty much that there's just no generic available, even if the provider says it's okay to switch to generic. Then number nine is other, which again, I have no idea what that means.